So, the first thing that I want to talk about today, I want to touch on two topics today. I've been seeing a lot of blogs going down and all of that, you mean. Um, see, and the thing about me, I like to I like to listen to what people are saying first, and I like to, you know, always give, you know, give my time enough to process the information, give y'all a great rebuttal, so I won't be, you know, coming up here, you know, emotional or something like that, because I'm not listening to everybody thinks, so I let everybody drop their stuff, and I'm just like, okay, I'll, you know, I'll um, respond as needed. Now, I just feel like, it's too much talk about easy to block happen, and I'm not responding to shit. It's just like, okay, boom. So, first and foremost, the goods battle. Now, I wasn't going to say nothing else about the goods battle. I feel like that my job was done. I feel like that um, I usually don't do bar for bars for my own battle, but for this time, I think I might do a bar for bar for my own battle just because we need to. Now, I just want to pay attention to details, right? You know what I'm saying? Because it's like, damn, cuz. It's like, okay, you, you, you know what I'm saying? Um, so, I'm going through, this has been the most, I think, clearest battle, right? But because that goods is so loved by the peers that's in battle rap and the media in battle rap, it's kind of making it look like, besides the fans, I love y'all though. Because I'm going in the comments and the fans is like, yo, I don't know. Y'all going at everybody. They like, yo, no matter what y'all talk about, how many blogs y'all dropping, that nigga lost. So I love the fans. The fans is clearing them niggas out. You dig what I'm saying? Like that. So this is not towards the fans. I, I, I appreciate y'all. My fan, I appreciate Battle Rap fans, period. Y'all y'all know what happened. So it's not y'all. You dig what I'm saying? It's the media. It's I'm shouting them niggas out. It's Uncle Ra. It's knowledge. It's no bars. It's 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 all them niggas. It's like, bro, this is the reason why I say my team, my personal team is the best team because my personal team. When I got back to the house, they told me everything that they thought I did wrong. Even though we won the battle, they like, listen, you gotta clean this up. You gotta clean it up. That's why y'all see me go in there and try to clean different things up every battle because I have a team that's behind me that don't think nothing I do is perfect and I want them to push me to that. Now, it gotta be an act that we start being real here, right? We gotta stop telling this man that it was a preference battle. It's nothing preference about this battle. It's nothing preference about this battle. We here's you, know, you know I mean I don't even know why we gotta do this, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't even know why we gotta do that. Some nigga like yeah, like Rex, he wasn't keeping it real. And I'm not gonna lie, I inboxed Rex. I said you you I said you usually keep it a dollar. I said I don't feel that. I said you can't choose and pick when y'all niggas wanna be real niggas or not, bro. That's not being real. That's not being real. If you wanna be a real nigga, be a real nigga 100 percent of the time. Don't be a real nigga 50% of the time and the other 50% of the time you don't want to be a real nigga. You got to be a real nigga 100% of the time. Here's the thing with Uncle Ryan Knowledge. If y'all don't want to give predictions for the battle, don't give nothing else for the battle then. If y'all don't have to say nothing, period. Y'all going out there telling this. Knowledge is so flip-floppy. He out there telling goods he won. He back in there telling me and Rock we won. <laughs> This nigga's crazy. I'm, 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 <laughs> like, like you know we gonna see this shit, right? Like, goddamn, knowledge, like, tighten up, bro. Like, you can't be that, you can't be that two sides of the coin shit, bro. Like, you dig what I'm saying? Like, that shit, you know we gonna watch the motherfucking interviews, bro. Like, tighten up. Um, Uncle Rod telling Lux, Lux, like, who won the battle? He like, it was a good battle. No, it wasn't. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't see... It's like this, man. Hmm? It's like... To me, I think this was like one of my clearest battles, right? Um, I think people get hindered when you, you know, when, when you tell somebody it was 2-1 either way or preference because then they don't think that they did as bad, right? So respectfully to Goods, because I feel like he got, you know, in pockets that I think he take that, he double up on that, triple up on that, fix a couple of things. I think good is going to be, um, he going to be good. I don't think that, you know, I don't, I didn't kill him. So I'll, I'll be the first one to say, I didn't, it, it wasn't a body, but it was just a gentleman's dirty. It was 3-0. Like every round to me was clear. 
Yes, did he do better in other rounds than the, the first? Yes. I mean, as you should. You get three rounds to try again. You dig what I'm saying? So one round was better than, than the more. But that don't mean we judge rounds by round. That's why we have three rounds. His first to my first. Okay, who won that round? His second to my second. Who won that round? I keep hearing, well, Easy, what, his second was better than his first, and then Easy's second went down from his first. Like, even if that's the case, what y'all think? What does that matter? How was his second to my second? Like, why Why is media acting dumb as hell right now? It's like, yo, they can't, yo, then, like, y'all, and then y'all letting media, I heard, I'm on Black Confess, I heard Tony Bro and Cola call, well, he was talking money, um, um, they don't understand, like, I don't, <laughs> y'all letting these niggas disrespect, like, people, it, like, you, you, he, they're, they're disrespecting niggas who's watching them talking about he was talking money, y'all don't understand it, like, how you gonna tell us what we don't understand? Do you understand it, nigga? Huh? Cause none of y'all niggas was y'all was y'all was dressing regular in there. I don't even think y'all niggas understand it. Don't try to be playing this 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 money shit now. Y'all don't know what the fuck he talking about. That nigga don't even know what he talking about. You know what I'm saying? Like, let's keep it. Like, come on, man. Like, let's keep it a dollar. You know what I'm saying? When you go home, respectfully the goods again, though. But when you go home and you hear a bar and say, yo, my cologne did Creed numbers, and then you find out that Creed did 200 million last year, it's like, okay, it sound good, but is it realistic? Anybody can talk money. They're doing the same thing right now with Gilly and Ross. What did, what did Gilly say to Ross? Do anybody know? The fuck how much money you got? Money don't unlame a lame nigga. You can talk, you can talk about whatever you want to talk about. Nigga can talk money to the ceiling. It don't, it don't, it don't, it don't matter. And my credit score almost at 800. So he's not talking to me. You dig what I'm saying? Like, just because, bro, we really from the trenches. So we don't feel it. We don't got to put on designer clothes to feel like we got bread. I got a polo shirt on now, a regular joint, three pack, $25. You hear me? No chain. I got the beads. And I'm sitting comfortably. You dig what I'm saying? Um, We understand the talk, bro. We understand the talk. Like, people got, people got, people got money. You know what I'm saying? Like that. We understand. Don't, don't try to tell the regular people that's watching. They don't understand money talk. That's disrespectful. It's disrespectful. And then... When they break down the bars, they tell one bar. They say, yo, he said, the money come. And then they stop. Where's the rest of the bars at? That one bar did not beat my whole round, bro. These <laughs> yo, they be like, yeah, they be like, so ask them niggas. They be like, so what bar that he said round two? They be like, yeah, uh, watching the bitch play with her pussy and the money come. And what else? He was talking that money shit. Come on, man. Y'all niggas, y'all niggas, I'm, 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 I'm calling it. Y'all cornballs. All y'all niggas is cornball. All y'all niggas. Rex was up there acting like a cornball. You dig what I'm saying? I ain't, onk, onk, my onk. I fuck with onk. He was on some cornball shit. He was on some cornball shit because y'all niggas got channels of 200,000 plus on y'all channels, bro. So if actually these niggas didn't physically watch the battle, y'all actually trying to sway a whole group of people that this battle was preference. It's not preference. 18,000 people voted after the join on Twitter. He had 25%. Come on, bro. 75, 25. So, you mean, out of every four, basically every four people, one person, you know what I mean? Like that. So, it's like, all right, cool. You dig what I'm saying? Like, bro, but we got to we gotta keep it. We got to keep it. We got to keep it a dollar. This nigga going on there trying to say, okay, and then another thing. Y'all want to keep saying preference. Uncle Rod is for you. Knowledge is for you. Next time you interview the bull, ask him why his sportsmanship is so trash. Don't let this nigga say you mean because this nigga's jumping all down my rounds and talking down my rounds. How about you ask him that? Y'all, 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 if, if y'all for the sport, right? Why is this nigga talking through all my rounds? Is that not, is, is, is that what the battle rap is supposed? I don't see none of y'all niggas ask him that though. 
You know what I'm saying? Like that. Sportsmanship was the worst sportsmanship that I ever battled a nigga, period. This nigga literally got the cup. Y'all seen this nigga in the third dancing on my shit, talking to the crowd while I'm trying to rap, bro. That is why nobody asking him that. Y'all being biased and shit. Angry fan, where your blog about at this niggas being the worst sportsmanship? Huh? Like, where's those blogs at? Because that was disgusting up there. Do you know why my second and third wasn't as flawless as the first? Is because this nigga was talking through my whole round. The whole time. <laughs> the whole time. It was literally a part of my third round where the crowd was laughing because he was moonwalking over there while I'm rapping, my nigga. Like, come on, that's corny as shit. Uncle Ron, talk about that. No bars, talk about that. Knowledge, talk about that. Three lettermen, three my nigga, but talk about that. We're not talking about that. Are y'all talking about this nigga had a minute and a half pause in the second round? Why is nobody talking about this nigga choking? Uncle Rod, talk about that. Knowledge, talk about that. Why is nobody, you mean y'all niggas is being biased as shit when it come to bull? Like, what the fuck is we talking about? If that was any other nigga with a minute and a half pause, y'all would have called that nigga a choke. Do y'all niggas know that they booed that nigga the third round and I told them niggas to calm it down, don't boo him? Do y'all know he was booed, right? Y'all know in the third round he was booed, right? Nobody's talking about that, though. All these fucking bloggers out here, nobody talking about that. I'm the only nigga that can keep it real over here. I haven't heard Uncle Ross say one thing about the choke, one thing about this nigga sportsmanship, or one thing about how is that a good battle? You tell me as a fan, bad sportsmanship, the nigga gets booed, and the nigga choke. Where in battle rap is do that become a good battle? No, I'm not. I'm not, man. I'm just y'all know I'm passionate when it comes to this shit. But you know you gotta talk to them niggas like that though sometimes, bro. You got to talk to these niggas like that because it's for real. I'm seeing shit. It's just disgusting. It's just disgusting for real. I just be like, damn, dog. Like, I looked at, especially I looked at Unk like, yo, he be unbiased majority of the time. And ask Unk this. I bet you I came up to Unk. I said, yo, your whole time you was uh interviewing this nigga. I said, I seen a little bite. I said, you was interviewing this nigga like y'all was friends. Instead of being like, yo, you're an interviewer, you know, you, 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 you know, you're part of media, you're interviewing good, you're interviewing easy. That's why I tried to not give them niggas no interviews. I'll go to champion. I'll go to champion. Because if we if we're gonna do that, if we're gonna do that, be biased for who we wanna be biased, I might as well just stick with the niggas from Philly. I might as well stick with champion and go to three letter men and and and, and, and Vada. You know what I'm saying? Like, because that shit right there, that's showing, like, come on, bro. Like, that, that, that's corny. Tell that nigga he lost. He lost the fucking battle. Tell that nigga he lost. It's okay. It's okay. Y'all's just so mad because that y'all was beating it down my fucking head. Oh, his aura is going to destroy you. You can't talk that drug shit to easy. You know what I mean? To goods. Yo, you're, he's going to. Yo, yo, before the battle, it was, it was all, oh, my God. Can easy do it? Now, after the battle. It's a lot of cries and, 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 and spoils and bags and all of that shit, bro. It, it be, but now I understand why Hitman don't do it, though. I understand why Hitman stay off of Twitter because it be like, yo, sometimes y'all niggas can get corny, bro. It, it, it can get corny. It can get corny, bro. It can get corny. I'm not going to even tell y'all who texts me and said 30s. Big niggas. From New York. You dig what I'm saying? Like, so, so, it's just that niggas, see, I, re I respect that. They don't say nothing publicly, but you know I mean, yo, E, blah, 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 but they not going to say he won. I had to text Swave. I said, I said, you the only New York nigga rapper out there that's keeping it a dollar. He said, I'm just telling the truth. I don't think he got one round. It, you know, it's nothing wrong with saying that, bro. It's nothing wrong with saying, yo, stand and get around. Like what, Sway, Sway, I, I mean, listen, man, I want to hear what Head Ice going to say. You dig what I'm saying? Like, because I was surprised. Usually Rex keeping a dollar. Usually Rex be keeping it a dollar. I know that's grown man bars and all that shit, but that's not how we play over here. 
what I'm saying? When chess battle Calico, we had to take that L. You dig what I'm saying? Like, we got to take that L. Like, we take our L's just like we take our W's. You know what I'm saying? Like that. So, it's like, boom, we not going to sit there and tell Chess he won the battle? What type of niggas would we be to, to bro? We, we, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> what type of niggas would we be to my little bro if we sit there and lie to that nigga? You know what we told him? Yo, your bars was better, but you know what's up. You know what's up. Come on, bro. That's real shit because that's how we all grow together. Let me tell y'all, and, and since, since, since Rex wanted to speak up, that's why Rex ain't getting no better. Because when I battle him, just, oh, my God, that's the best Rex we've seen. That's the, y'all tried to get this nigga around so bad, this nigga went to Rum Nitty and died. And died. <laughs> you dig what I'm saying? The same thing, the same thing with these niggas. Like, y'all got to tell these niggas areas to get better so they can get better. Because now, this nigga like, okay, I can talk this money talk. Go to the next battle, and he, he might die, die. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like that. Like, he might die. You, he might he might die. He got to change some shit. That's the point of telling the nigga he did get better. He wasn't trash, trash. You know what I'm saying? He just had a couple dry spots. He needed to fix a certain shit. He wasn't direct. Everything that y'all telling me, I wasn't. That was him. I really study this shit. I really study the game, bro. That's why I'm just saying like that. I just wanted to address that one part. We about to address something else, though. I just wanted to address that one part because I'm like, damn, the, the, it's disgusting out here. It's disgusting. I'm not going to lie. Black Compass Media, y'all becoming fans. Polo text me, Polo is my guy. Polo been rocking, but you know what I mean? But I'm going to keep it a dollar. Y'all niggas is becoming more fans, bro. You know what I'm saying? I don't owe none of y'all niggas nothing. I don't owe none of y'all niggas nothing, and I ain't scared of none of y'all niggas. You dig what I'm saying? But, like, but here's the thing. Y'all niggas is becoming more fans than analysts, than media. Y'all fan niggas. Tighten up. Tighten up. You dig what I'm saying? Like, that shit ain't dead, bro. That's why when Champion of the Year come up and we looking for judges, we don't want y'all niggas on there because y'all niggas is biased as shit. Y'all can't, ju can't judge a clear-ass battle. I'm concerned for our medium battle rap, bro. Niggas can't judge a clear battle. I don't want a nigga judging me for no 100,000. If a nigga just seen that battle, seen Easy vs. Goods battle, and tell me it's 2-1 either way, I'm scared of them niggas, bro. I'm scared of them niggas. I'm scared of them niggas. And to try to insult my intelligence to talk about he's talking money, we don't understand it. Like, who the fuck do y'all think y'all talking to? Niggas is crazy. Tighten up. Y'all media niggas is crossing the line to be fan niggas. Fuck is we talking about, bro? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? Tighten this shit the fuck back up. Because y'all niggas could be replaced. You know what I'm saying? Y'all niggas could be replaced. For real. M motherfuckers make new media niggas every day. Seriously. 